What's up, guys? NBA talk with the last video of the night. Um, it's a wrap. Another series is wrapped up. Uh, Golden State Warriors were predicted to win this series. They were predicted to win this game. And they won. Uh, 125 Golden State Warriors to 121 Portland Trailblazers. Um, this was one tough bout. Uh, the Portland Trailblazers did not want to go down. They held the uh, lead for a credible amount of time. Um, they uh, they switched leads a huge number of times. Um, it was just a fantastic showing from the Portland Trailblazers. So let me just get into the stats real quick. Um, Aminu with 16 points, um, 9 rebounds, 2 assists, 2 steals, 3 out of 5 from the 3-point range. This guy has stepped up big time in this series uh, for this team. Playing good offense and defense, uh, spreading the floor. Um, we have Harkless with 13 points and 3 rebounds. Um, he shot 3 from 6 from the 3-point um, range. Uh, Mason Plumley. Uh, five points, uh, six rebounds, and four assists. Um, played 23 minutes. Uh, McCollum, 27 points, eight rebounds, five assists. Um, three out of five from the three-point range. And then we have uh, Damian Leonard with 28 points. 12 for 12 from the free throw line. Seven rebounds, seven assists. Even though he shot seven out of 24 uh, from the field. Um, we look towards the bench. We got a huge number from Crab, Alan Crab, on uh, twenty points from him. We got some stuff from Ed Davis, um, six points and seven rebounds, three block shots. Uh, the team shot forty-one percent from the field, forty-four percent from the three-point range, um, forty-seven rebounds, twenty assists, only ten turnovers, and nine steals. I'll I'll get into the whole summary um of them. Uh, Golden State Warriors. Uh, Harrison Barnes with eight points, seven rebounds, thirteen points from Draymond Green, eleven rebounds from him, two and six assists, two steals and a block shot, just being himself, basically. Um, we have Clay Thompson with thirty three points. Um, Clay uh, Stephen Curry just letting him be the guy. To run the show. Um, 6 of 9 for the 3 point range. 13 out of 17 from the field overall. So a huge helping from Klay Thompson. And Stephen Curry. He had a huge help too. Um, 29 points. 11 assists. 5 rebounds. 10 out of 20 from the field. Mm, 5 out of 11 for the 3 point range. And then we got a couple players off the bench. Barbosa with 8 points. Iguodala with five, eight points from Izili, um, ten points from Sean Livingston, um, Space giving you five points, uh, fifty-one percent from the field from Golden State Warriors, forty-three percent from the three-point range, twenty-eight assists, forty-four rebounds, uh, five steals. They turned the ball over sixteen times, courtesy of the. Pro Trailblazers. And that's pretty much it. So Golden State Warriors move on to the final round of the Western Conference. The Western Conference uh, Finals to await either Thunder or San Antonio Spurs. So that will be for later. Um, Stephen Curry's back. He does seem like he missed a step. He played phenomenal this game. He seemed like he he's back to normal. and Which is a very problem for everyone in his way for the championship. So we'll see. And they got Draymond Green on his level. Playing with energy. High energy. It's Clay Thompson holding it down. Sean Livingston playing a huge backup role. Uh, it's going to be phenomenal. The team's all together healthy. Let's see what awaits them in the finals. Um, Portland Trailblazers. You have to give it up to them. They, this is why I really have grown to love this team. Um, 
this team was supposed to be not even in the playoffs. It was predicted to not even make it, this team. Damon Litter, the only person to, uh, left of the starting five. Uh, remember, this team used to be a 50-plus win team. Yet last year, they had Wesley Matthews, Nicholas Batum, LaMarcus Aldridge, and Rob, um, Rob Lopez. Uh, what you have here is pretty much um, pretty much role players or people who are most likely to come off the bench or stuff. Uh, but you have to give it up. You have to give it up because the way that how they play on defense and the way how they play on offense, the way how they give you energy and effort every time, they don't care how strong you are, they're going to come at you. And they gave... Oh, uh, Golden State Warriors, everything they can handle. Um, the analyst behind me said the same thing. Um, Aminu turning up a notch. Uh, Mason Plumley becoming an overall uh, um, big man. Pretty much like Paul Gasol or Joaquin Noah playing defense, rebounding, uh, passing the ball, becoming a good passer. This will look very good in his resume. Uh, McCollum. The most improved player of the year. Playing phenomenal. He played phenomenal in that fourth quarter tonight. He he deserves his he 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 put up effort, man. He stepped up. When everyone left, he stepped up. Damien Leonard, um, he kept it buck. Uh he still struggled um this series. But he gave it everything he had. Uh he he walked in with no fear whatsoever. He just went in. He knew he had a job to do. He knew he had to lead these guys, and he did the best he could. This team looks great. Um, Terry Scott, a phenomenal head coach, um, deserves a nomination. Like he, he came second in Coach of the Year. Well deserved. This guy coached a team that was not supposed to even make it, according to critics. I thought that too. But they proved the whole world wrong. They proved, they proved the whole world wrong. They made it to the semifinals. They beat the Clippers even though in the last... Yeah, I would say the last, maybe last game or two so of the series. Blake, Blake Griffin and uh, Chris Paul went down with injuries. They still made it a competitive um, series. And they beat the Los Angeles Clippers, who were supposed to be better. They had more personnel. They had more talented uh, players on the uh, roster. But they proved it wrong. And what's going to be much better is free agency. They're going to get loads of players, um, just the way how they look. They're going to have another... Hopefully, they go for a key star... Someone they could rely on down low, maybe in the uh, power four spot. Um, yeah, like so, uh, another big score to help them out. Uh, just and get some, just beef up that uh, bench a little bit more because it looks like it's going to become great. You have Crab, Alan Crab being a great player. You could have him, you could have Ed Davis, and you got Henderson. Now you just add a few more players. And you got yourselves a playoff roster. A true playoff roster. Um, that's it for me. That's it for tonight. Uh, give it up for the Portland Trailblazers. Give it up for the Golden State Warriors. Uh, moving on to the second round. Third round and final round. Um, tomorrow. The only game. San Antonio Spurs versus Oklahoma City Thunder. At Oklahoma City Thunder. Yeah, Oklahoma. Oklahoma City Thunder might have the chance to move on to face the Golden State Warriors because they're in the lead. They're three to two. Or maybe San Antonio Spurs has something to say about it. We'll never know. So tomorrow, there it is. So peace out, guys.